Outlander gets its own Twitter emoji and you'll love it. Outlander has got its own Twitter emoji. If you are worried about the show deviating from a certain couple, this emoji keeps it rooted. Not many shows get to have their own Twitter emojis. They also don't all get to keep their emojis. The shows that do have them are extra special and now Outlander has joined the ranks. For those worried about the show taking a step away from the initial couple, this emoji makes the future clear. As fans celebrated the news of the new Twitter emoji, Sam Hewn learned all about it himself. He was excited to see it. It's not clear how these Twitter emojis are decided but we're certainly not complaining, right? Outlander's Twitter emoji is focused on Season 4, which premieres in a little more than a week. It's from the key art, with Claire and Jamie's face side by side. As one fan pointed out, it's almost as good as having their faces on the postage stamp. It's not just the show's name that gives you the emoji, either. Tweet hashtag the Frasers and you'll also see the couple pop up. It's magical. The addition of the emoji comes off the back of Outlander landing second place in the Great American Read. Sosinox joined together and forced to make sure the novel series landed as close to the top as possible. Being behind To Kill a Mockingbird is certainly nothing to grumble about. As Diana Gabaldon shared in her thank you tweet, getting this spot on the list it could have encouraged Twitter to offer up the emoji. After all, it's clear that this is an extremely important show and book and fans will be proud to show off their emoji. The best thing is that it is all about Claire and Jamie. Sure, I love the other couples but this has always been Claire's story about Jamie. Their love story began it all and it will also finish it all. Just the two of them in the Outlander Twitter emoji is perfect. What do you think of the Outlander Twitter emoji? Are you excited about what it means for the series on social media? Share your thoughts in the comments below.